Jesus. I'm honored to marry. The Lord is good. And all the time. And that is his nature. Wow. Wonderful children of God. During our last Friday prayer program, we were able to establish, based on the, the word of God available to us, that we are seated in the hand of the Lord scattered on earth to germinate and to bear fruits. This assertion was made based on God's word in Mark's Gospel chapter 4 from verse 26 34. That was the gospel that was presented to us by the church just the past Friday. Jesus said, The kingdom of God is like a man scattering seeds on the field. The seeds grow and bear fruits. We are started based on this word of God that each human being is a divine seed. Send from above on earth for the purpose of fruitfulness for the benefit of God's kingdom. Today, God speaks to us in like manner but with a different expression. That we from the Lord to the earth. So you are on mission here on earth. Heaven has sent you on a mission. Heaven has sent me on a mission. All of us, we are missionaries from heaven to the earth. Before you and I came to be king of nation here on earth, we existed in the mind of God. We were first in the mind of God before the appropriate time came and he said, My child, go on mission to the earth. Just like some of you are now at this point that you are doing your studies. Your certificate is not yet born. It is still in your mind. It is still in view. But there will come a time that the certificate will be given birth to. It will be given to you. It will be issued to you. Perhaps maybe you have a project, you have a dream. The dream is still in your mind. At the time that project will come forth in reality. So before you and I came to earth on mission from God, mind of God, we existed in the mind of God. And when the time came, God sent you forth on mission to the earth. I came, he sent me forth on mission 
through the earth. He reached from this background that he spoke to the prophet in the first reading. He told him that before you were born, I knew you. Is somebody hearing me? The Lord told Jeremiah, before you were born, I knew you. I called you. And I sent you as a prophet to the nations. Before we were born, children of God, we existed in the mind of God. And at the appropriate time, he sent us out. He sent us forth to come on mission on earth. He tells Jeremiah, before I found you in the wound, already I knew you. I have appointed you sent you as a missionary to be a prophet to the nations. And so I want each and every one of us hearing me this day to know that you are a missionary from heaven to the earth. You have been sent sent by God. You are not here by accident. You are here based on God's purpose. Here by accident, August. We are here on purpose. God has sent us. God has sent you. He has sent me. All of us, Chico, we are here on earth. On purpose, we have been sent by God. Just as He called Jeremiah and sent him. We too, He has called us and He has sent us on earth as missionaries. We are messengers of God from heaven to the earth. Our worry should be the content of our message. The gift to the world should be the message of love. Of. Wow. That is the purpose for which we are sent here. To show love to one another, to make the world a better place. We are sent to the world to make the world a better place. To show love to whoever that I meet. Not just to my fellow brothers and sisters. To all that time I may, I should show love. That should be the content of my message to the world. All of us, my dear sister, we are sent from heaven to earth as missionaries to show love, to demonstrate love. It is why the second reading tells us every other thing you do. Jeremiah, listen to me. I say every other thing you do. If you do not have love, try to believe in God, you have faith on the peoples of your mission on earth, Jeru. If you do not love, if you do not have God in you, the purpose for which God has sent you here on earth is defeated. I should be able to show love to you, to improve your life when I have contact with you. Us. You can do whatever you think. 
you are doing or you are best in doing. If you do not have love, then you are very God. Jesus is our standard. Jesus is our standard. From the gospel acclamation. Chapter 4. I want us to start from verse 17. Reading is praise on verse 18. Luke's gospel chapter 4. Jeremiah's wife. Listen. Luke's gospel chapter 4 from verse 17. Jesus quoted from Isaiah saying, The Spirit of the Lord is upon me. He has sent me forth. He has sent me forth to do what? For, to bring good news to the poor. Good news to somebody. When you come to the life of someone, will the person be able to say, Thank God I met this person? Or will the person say, Cost me a day I knew you? of somebody there are certain persons that have bastardized the lives of others that someone will look them in the face and say I regret that day I met you maybe as a boyfriend to that girl you so messes up his or her life You treated her so badly. But you are meant to be a good news to anyone that you come in contact with. He says he is sent just as Jesus was sent. So you do you are sent. Just as Jeremiah was sent. So you do you are sent. You are sent to be Child of the living God, an epitome of love. You see Jesus as the standard. He said, I am sent to bring good news to the poor. Verse 18. Verse 18, where we have our acclamation. release to all captives to, be, to, to release those who are captive to the believers Father deliver me it is not only Father that will deliver people Father we only deliver people from demonic attacks and oppressions but each and every one of us has power and capacity to deliver a fellow brother from a particular problem or a sister from a particular problem. Is somebody here ready? Listen to me. When hunger is that person has been held captive by hunger. Chima, if you give the person two thousand, go and eat. You have done deliverance. Yes, you have done deliverance. You have delivered a person from the shackles of hunger. So, you are a deliverer too. It is not only father. It is not only a pastor that can deliver. It is not only a reverend father that can deliver people. Martins, you can deliver somebody. Somebody is under a yoke of a particular problem. If you help that person out of that problem, you have delivered the person. Sent to you to deliver those who are captives. To deliver those who are captives. And it is not only priest to work, child of God is to deliver God's people from spirit that 
There are many, many other powers that attack human beings. Hunger can attack somebody and hold somebody captive. Ignorance. Can you take some time to open the eyes of the blind? Somebody who is ignorant. The person is blind to the truth. And you devote some quality time to teach. When you do, you gain knowledge. You are giving the blind new sight. Jesus said, I am anointed and I am sent. To do all this, he did it all those based on love. Chapter 10, verse number 38. Through the power of the Holy Spirit, he went about doing good and setting free those who were under the dungeon of the enemy. It's like the paraphrase of this word of God in Luke's Gospel, verse 17 to 19. You are sent by God for a proof. In order to be an agent of love to those you really love. Listen to me. God's word to Jeremiah should make you, should make me. For he told Jeremiah that if you are dismayed, that if you do not carry out this, Dismay. Do not be dismayed before them. It is like the Lord saying that if you disgrace me by not carrying out my command, I will disgrace you before the people. So if we do not choose a living God, show love to those who are in need. If we do not carry out the vision for which we are sent, there is a time that God will disgrace us. And that will be when you come before Him, before His judgment through. Jesus, going back to Him again, He wrote the gospel text. He came. He sent from above, sent from heaven. He came down to earth. And he was to live and The purpose of his mission. School. Where did he first go to? He first went to his family. Matthias. He first went to his family. He made out the purpose of his call. Jesus first did what? Went to his family. He first went to his family. I want you to imagine that it is from this that we have that assume that charity begins at work. Charity begins at work. Charity begins at work. Charity begins at home. So if I am sent from God to start with my family, it should start from the family. And then it escalated out of the family and people on the street, people within my region, people within my city, experience the love that God has put into my spirit and has sent me to the earth to share with others. It has to start through home. But listen to me. There are many people that are very charitable, very loving, very loving to people out there. But then their very family members do not enjoy their charity. One person out there that everybody on the street 
is pressing you to hide your family members. Do not know of your goodness. Your goodness is pseudo goodness. Far from all, it has to stop from the evil. You are a good man, but your wife does not know of your goodness. You are only acting on the script. You are only putting it out for school. God is just the people. Your wife she first know that you are good. Your children should know that you are good. You are only putting up the show out there. You are very wicked to your children. Very wicked to your wife. But when you go to the office, you want everybody to know that you are a good man. Hey, if you have a problem, come on, I will help you solve this problem. <laughs> have you started from home? Will your wife testify that you are a good man? Will your children testify that you are a good man? It has to start from home. You go about preaching to people. Oh, I said Jesus as your personal Lord and Savior. You want to give Jesus to others. Have you given Jesus to your children? Many a times, great men of the church, they are children and wayward. Maybe the Catholics and the children do not come to church. But they will be telling people outside, believe Jesus. Many pastors, he God will open your eyes to see what their children do. You will be surprised. And many a times I say, perhaps even if we, the priests, will marry and raise children, maybe our children will be likewise. Many a times we make it. Our families have been go out there. In order to do whatever that we believe is good, it has to start from the family. Came from heaven to earth, took it to his family. And this is where many people get it wrong. When Jesus told the apostles, I am sending you forth, but first go to the lost sheep of Israel. People thought Jesus was being partial. No. as the first experience of madness before people in the street. He wasn't being partial. He was only setting a standard. And here we are told he went back to his own family and began to teach them the principles of heaven in the synagogue. And yes, where oh you are a great man why not start by doing miracles but why start with telling us about the world start by doing miracles let there be multiplication of bread here so that all of us will eat and jesus told them i knew that you are going to quote that parable to me physician heal yourself you are a great man, we know how good and great you are. Start doing those things that will be benefit in the flesh. But then they did not know what God was offering. They want to be a spiritual revolution, trying to believe in God before the outside, the body will receive. And when you told them that God does not work, as human beings think that we are grieved. See the book of Isaiah, chapter 15, 5, verse number 8, that as the heavens are far apart with the earth, so the thinking of God is apart from the thinking of men. That if your brother is a great man, he should come and then buy everybody a car before you will start talking about. God's kingdom. And Jesus told them, 
remember that when is farmer in the land, the prophet was not sent to any widow. He did not know Israel. He was sent to the widow of Zarephath. There were many lepers also in Israel. But none of them benefited from the healing of Elijah. This area. People of God. People of God. 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 He has sent you on mission. And your mission here is to show love, to make the world. Your mission on earth is to make the world a better place through love. And it has to start through your home. It has to start through your home. Jesus went straight to his own family, to his own home. And where he was, preaching to them in order to open their spirits to receive in the physical. They were agitated. Listen to me. Do not get it wrong. Before you receive in the physical, you have to first of all receive in the spirit. They went to them. But they wanted to have Jesus do it the other way around. was preaching to them. Their minds were set on palpable things, physical things. And when Jesus gave them this power, they got very annoyed. Used him. They took him to the brow of the hill in order to throw him down headlong, to kill him. But what happened? Jesus eluded them and he went his way. Of the name Jesus. 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 God, in this mission that God has sent to us, it is not because. He has sent us so we are not going to have a position. You will have a position. You will need to oppose you. People will stand against you. Remember in that first reading, the Lord telling Jeremiah, Tells you. But because I am with you, we see, they will not overwhelm me. We see that coming to pass in the life of Jesus. He went straight to his own countrymen. Listen to me. It wasn't people outside of the family of Jesus that wanted to kill him. His own very own. They stood against him. He has visited us. Rather than bringing cars, bringing donkeys, as he went at that time, he's only telling us about heaven. Let us kill him. And they wanted to throw him off the cliff. But what happened? What was the reaction of Jesus? We are doing well his way. Listen to me. Come on, check. Amo, come. You think Jesus did not have power to fight those people? Come on. I said, do you think Jesus did not have power to stand? Jeremiah, listen to me. Here. Jesus had every power. She did. Jesus had every power, my friend. He had every power he had wanted. He would just. And those people will be bent. He had that authority and power. When the word of God said, he eluded them and he left. Now I put up. How do you react to a provoked? What is your reaction? In terms of provocation, that is how many of us lose it. See me like this, so this small boy. Oh, you are pushing it, I got there. Let me show you that. Ah, talk to you from the beginning. Let me show you this person that I have power. You have lost it. You have lost it. You have lost it. Child of God, you have lost it. Those who have power, they do not react in that manner. When they are provoked. <laughs> Do you know that most of the times, and, uh, if I just love and you are there, go. But later, <laughs> his voice will come to do a good mission. <laughs> that 
And the king sent the cock and 
Ani Vulture It will all up in the hand wings you know If there is any blockage You can fly And get to the other point But I want it as quick as possible And I want you to believe that this The king's part on the ground Let it be your mind not dry up Before you people will run and then get here How many of you will accept And then speed will put on the ground That it will make it back Before The speed will be dry up And then pa, 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 You are running In order to undo to get back Before the speed will be dry up And so the king sent the cock And a, a vulture And they went. God, the red card, and we're coming back. And all of a sudden, the vulture noticed some carcass, the body of a dead animal. And the vulture told the cock, Ha! I cannot bypass this. This food like this, I cannot. Old vulture, you know that whatever you want to eat is out there in the kingdom. Let's hurry, the king is waiting. The king is waiting, and the vulture said, What I see here is what I will eat. Wait for me, I will finish with this carcass before we take the message back to the king. The God will say, please, if you want to okay, be fast, please, let's be going. You know that type of thing that you need to your legs on the ground. When somebody is not being there, fast as you wanted. The God was, please, let's be, let's be going, let's be going. And the vulture spent some quality time to devour the carcass. And then they were getting to the kingdom. To the palace. Everything was said, the king was just there, taking tea. Waiting, and when they come in, just put the cup and they go. And then, all of a sudden, they pumped in. And the king was like, Oh my God, why took you people so long? And the cup presented the cup to the king. We got it quite okay, we will be here on time. But my fellow messenger, the vulture saw carcasses on the road and he was eating of it. And the king said, is that true? And the vulture said, yes. What happened? The king received the cup. Red cup from the cock and say because you are a faithful servant I reward you with this cup he put it on the head of a cock that's why you have the comb on the cock's head and then he called the voice of step forward because you are a bad messenger I fed you and you went about doing your own business then he took the hot water that he was taking to you poured on his head The vulture wanted to touch and it poured on his neck. That's why the vulture does not have hair around his own neck. Child of the living God, you may laugh, but listen to me. Then. So much to take home. So much to take home. God has sent us here on earth on mission. If you like, waste your time eating carcasses. There will be a time that you stand before God. What you do, depending on what God has sent you, will determine whether before God you will be rewarded with heaven or you will be punished in hell. In the name of Jesus the Lord, that we shall do the mission of the Lord to reach out to people in love that when we come to Him in heaven, Before his judgment seat, he will reward us with heaven. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Um, um,
Mambo, but don't smack up. We can't change men. Andu lam almesi. We can't almesi eh. Sweet night. Uwo umpe kita niyo we uwo we kwand moba sema iyo we kwand alo sekita ni yesa si yesi si mume ata shachi sira utapu. Ya ulang lewe sinahan Shachi Sipo ho kinen kane na Maruku Tiki show ni Yunisha kumu kala trata Yesu ka Ane si e Ma ku Kali jini ka tato lo anu shamene Ano uite ma Ino kenta Nura ka Mumede Mwe ta Isuna O Laka uwe Makamu Andu lo Sekitane Alu nya Iye tale Mena Diabolo ne E nya Iye tale Sesi do Mbendinga Pa Iwa Andu Ale Sekitane Yo Sumeni Shisumu Iye ta Kiti Yesu Mulane Andesi Kati kwa Kutwa Diuke Sine Sipuwe hene na Satatu Kuti Sitiu Kitane Sipa Manai Chimangova Kitane yo Iyami yungu Kishima yonde Ani yami fao Ulu kishima na Chima ngeri seri Mujaiwa kumami yu Maluha yu chie Hama wazio kape yu chela Sulu kishima yonde Fase Chima ngeri Sito ngu wa uva Kitali kiyamu Ngo asipaye Malati nise kitane kasha chocha Paya nisi mani mungu Kishima na kinu mwondo Dei hiya minyane na ala ga mwen pulani Mwen kwa lo mwuki mwen mwuki chuli yuyo Kwa la mwen tuwe kitana Apa mwuki chuli yuyo Ijiji ni mwen Mayo, kau iya yang nego million belambok kisah mewah ni, batu iya kau, iya lugi cuyu kau mau mulai ufatu viga, uli bangun a, inya kita kikinu kisah mau kuat kau, amaki ufatu uli bayu ni, uli uli ni maklum kau sertifikat. We want to make that there. We can make it. We are doing now. We are making a certificate. We can make it. We are doing by the way. Step by step, step by step, take it. So we can move on. Move on. We need the mind of God. Before we came to existence, we existed in the mind of God in heaven. Kan aman orang tu, ayuh lah ye, mereka kan ayuh menunggu ye dia. Yang ni phone ni sese, eh ni pun kita tunggu lah ram phone. Maka tak kumur dia, dia ni muti ni, muti ni macam macam. Eh, siapa yang dia ayam lah, yang tu kita ni, ubah kacau ye orang tu. You belong to God. You are a missionary 
from heaven to earth by God on mission. Look in that direction, I call that hero. You are not in that area. Pressure eye for God. You are not here by accident. On purpose. Oba gunga aru tindu kita ne pressure chweka. You are sent. Ati no kita ne pressure chweka anga wa. Pressure eye for Maluka. Eye for me. Mani no kumama. Chokyo Jesus, I 
fact that you are not inside in the lamba, you chave la mutalo Yesu ba duwe chanda tulono kidumo kitale chana ki abaga tesi doshima a e a ta ido na Yesu enchienda ne ke ino na ma prea bu awa na ma pro yesia ka mo apa e te chim kune atidi e lo du tidi yesu na ka pe tidi ujela ka pe tidi ujela Do you know that expression that the white man will say, you are a bad news, you are a bad influence. But we ought to be good news to our brothers and sisters. But the people who are not in the world, they are killed. We don't know what to do here, they are innocent. We don't know what to do here, we don't know what to do here, we don't know what to do here, we don't know what to do here. Mais 
Jesus. We are able to do that. But you want to show the world that you are a good person. And I will go and tell you, yeah, that we was you was you by Yahoo. Was you want to you are very stingy? You will hear who make a cowl alone now. Do I am 
Eliakio we we kumagaya. But Saba hata wala chichamu kuhu wefa chyo mwaweka. Shati yami yeye kumaga. Ipilayo wala ha Yesu Christu aka wana alifabi yenga. But yami na yeye kumaya yaka ye mwane. He presented himself. Dene mbane de vye mwongo. Wefa ewe kwa hufa choka. Shifti si yuna. Jansa ni kolo. ukasichia <laughs> Sisi ni kadi tosh mana kitane. Mane isi kusida tiri hashina ni pibi sewa. Yangi mapita. Yo de tuna na kuvesi dawa. Hama wasia kuletu ngoda. Some day you stand before the Lord. You will give an account of your life. Petro, the day is coming. Ba buti ba toro ngara. Ngu onwe for free. Kia binyane. When you are going to stay for the life that he has given you, the mission that he has given you, nobody will account. My phone is here. It's in the middle. 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 Hey, heaven. It's in the middle. 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 Shaka Kai 
Il 